Hey guys, how's it going? Today I want to speak about the subject of if science permitted it, would it be acceptable to remove negative character traits? Well, I think, why not? There's, um, the brain is kind of like a machine. I mean, I know we have all these ways of thinking about the souls and all that stuff, and it's been proven though. You don't eat correctly, you don't sleep correctly, you don't take care of yourself. Your brain's not gonna work well, and eventually it's, uh, it's gonna give, you know? It's not gonna be correct. So that's the thing. if we're able to modify the way that our brain works so that we can be more productive, can be more happy, can, uh, for some people who are, let's say, homeless or something like that, and they just can't function in society, and they could change their way of being to, or even people who are alcoholic or have dependencies and stuff, they, they could change it to be more positive for themselves. Well, they would live a longer life. I think a lot of the the bad approach to that, the bad way of thinking of all these things happens because we think of, we'll say, uh, maybe movies where they show that there's a evil scientist that's basically um, doing things uh, that are bad for the world or taking over the world or whatever it is. And that kind of gives the image of this guy is basically going to change the way that we think and make us go like in the book uh, 1984 of uh, Orson Welles, you know, where we just live under a government that is basically dictating every single move and every single thing. But here we're talking about being able to change things within your brain so that you function better, your memory is better, you're stronger, faster, you're happier, and uh, why not in the end if you can do that and create a way of living that is better for yourself then do it and that's why science is there and of course some people are going to do bad things but at the same time maybe maybe there's a lot of good that can happen from it too so let's not shut the door on it and let's see when the actual technologies come that allow us to do that uh, let's see how they do work and let's see if they do uh, allow us to have a better world. So that's it. That's all I have to say on the subject. Have a great day, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.